Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome to the new workshop. Today I'm going to be showing you how we're going to upgrade the lights in here with the help of American Green Lights. It was really great working with them. They sent over a full uh, schematic of what everything's going to look like, previews of what the shop is going to look like. These lights are insanely nice and uh, I can't wait to get in here for filming and everything. It's going to be perfect as they are absolutely flicker free uh, LEDs. So I'm really excited about that. Uh, the ceiling mounts in here are a little bit interesting, so we're going to use some flat bar steel like this to mount all of the lights and they'll just set on there. Without further ado, let's uh, get into installing all of these and uh, we'll go from there. So here's kind of the unique power situation in the shop. We have all these metal rafters, but I had uh, all of the previous lights taken down since they were just fluorescents and had these boxes put up. These are all switched boxes, so there's about 15 of them here on the ceiling. So all of these lights, we're just going to wire to plugs and plug in there. That way we don't have to wire anything back to the breaker box. Should make things a little bit smoother and a relatively easy install. So we'll start by getting everything unboxed. Throughout this entire shop, I used three different types of lights. I used a four strip, a three strip, and a two strip. I knew where all of these went based on these schematics that they sent to get the lighting that I needed throughout the shop. Basically, the reflector plugs into the housing, making the install extremely easy and wiring everything up really easy as well. Using some self-tapping screws, I'll get the housing screwed down to the steel flat bar so that we can hang it on the ceiling. So now that that is installed, I did the same thing on the opposite side, so now we are ready to get everything wired up. So we'll start by cutting the wire that we needed to length. For this, I'm just using some 16 gauge three strand wire. And I had a buddy at the shop helping me with all of this since uh, electricity is not normally my thing. So we'll get these all stripped off and then get it inserted into the housing and then get everything matched up by color using the provided wire nuts to get everything wired together. So this has built-in tabs for cleaning up all the wires. So we'll use a bit of those to help get everything set. Then just some electrical tape around each one to ensure that the nuts never come off. So then we'll use the standard three wire plugs and get the other end stripped off so that we can get the plug ready to go. So we'll get those stripped and then install it on the plug to make it a really easy install for this shop. This is definitely the way that worked best. There's a lot of different other methods for hanging these, but uh, like I said, for this shop, this is what worked really well. So that one is done. All of the other lights were done the exact same way as well. So then I'll bring the reflector over, get those two connected, and then again, use the built-in wire management there to ensure that all of the cords are out of the area where we need to be screwing things in. So we got the cord out of the way. Now we can use some screws to attach the two together. This makes for a really easy setup. Uh, to get everything wired and then be able to put the reflector on instead of having to deal with tighter spaces. So this will rest right on those steel trusses and we'll get them lined up based on the schematics that American Green Light sent. We'll get that plugged in and you can see the light light up. So now we'll do the exact same thing for all of the others. We'll kind of speed through this just showing you all of the lights going in as we put them in. It was really cool to be able to see this shop becoming a lot brighter. It was obviously very dark before, and as we're installing these lights, this shop just absolutely brightens up like crazy. Uh, definitely more so than I ever expected, um, but these lights definitely gave off a ton of lighting, and it looked almost exactly like they had in the uh, schematics for it. So these lights back here are a little bit smaller, so we tied three of them together on a single wire to plug in, and uh, gave plenty of light in this area, which is mostly for storage. It's now been seven months since installing these lights, and uh, here are kind of my thoughts on it. So that's the lighting in the shop. I'm definitely really happy with the way that everything turned out for filming purposes. I couldn't have asked for a better setup. This is pretty amazing. There's absolutely zero flicker from these lights and the energy savings has been pretty amazing too. Uh, with just a few fluorescents that were in here, uh, the electricity bill is basically the same as what we have right now, uh, which is really nice to see. So if you have any lighting needs for your shop, definitely contact American Green Lights. They can definitely get you hooked up uh, and they'll get something worked up for you, uh, for your shop to figure out exactly what you need to get the light that you need in your space. Subscribe right over here and click here for another awesome video. That's gonna do it for this one. Have a great day, everybody.